It's a joyful day here at Colorado Christian University. A new chapter begins for CCU. Another step on our track from a good to a great university. So let the word go forth from this place to the ends of the earth. May Jesus Christ be praised. <laughs> Praise Jesus. Today we dedicate to our Lord Jesus the first new building, so far as I know, ever constructed for the purposes of Colorado Christian University. The world doesn't need another secular university. It doesn't need another liberal university. It desperately needs a university that honors Jesus Christ. This is a uh, academic building it is a building which will house uh, 14 classrooms in which over the years ahead, tens of thousands, maybe hundreds of thousands of students will attend class and a, a large portion of our faculty will be housed for their offices. Ultimately, this is just a building. It is your commitment to be a lifelong learner that matters. Learn, think, let yourself be disrupted. It can produce useful and necessary change in you and those around you. Students, I'm so happy for you. I am so happy that you have a building that's worthy of your time and your study because I know what we have planned for you. What God has planned for your life is that you are going to change the world. The importance of this day cannot be overstated. The creation of such a grand building has been long dreamed of its opening is long anticipated, and I know its existence will be long enjoyed. You are a prestigious university of international acclaim. I've often spoke of how well you prepare students for a balanced life that's dedicated to God, career, family, and service to the community. I want to thank you for the opportunity to dedicate to this, this cross, this important feature of our campus, in my father's memory today. May this cross in his memory stand as a reminder of what Jesus did for us and an encouragement for what the students who walk past it are called to return to him. We had over 600 individuals, foundations, businesses give gifts specifically designated to help build this building. A phase one of our campaign has been completed with no debt acquired by the university. Looking towards the future, we have already started on the very next building. It's going to be a 300-bed residential apartment building. Um, it's the second building in our campus development um, program. Jesus, light the fire of truth within these walls. Shelter this building under your rock of refuge. When future generations ask, what did this building mean? Let us say it is a memorial to Christ-centered instruction of truth forever. God bless America, my home sweet home.